Go ahead. Hey guys, welcome to this week's team call for Team Fit Natural and Team Spark. Today we're going to be talking about understanding volume because honestly, I think it's one of the most confusing topics as a coach. So I think it's a really good opportunity for us to chat about it and explain it step by step so everyone has a better understanding. Um, before we do that, I want to give a couple of announcements. Um, first of all, we have our challenge group for October starting on the 19th. Um, so we should definitely be starting to post about that and recruiting people for that. Um, and remember, you want to be sharing how challenge groups have impacted your life and not just putting up pictures of Autumn and, you know, Sagi. So definitely make it more about you and less about them. Um, the hammer and chisel sneak peeks are on Beachbody On Demand. So make sure you check them out. They are awesome. Um, let's see, what else did we say? Um, and the big, what, what happened? Super Saturday. Oh, yeah, thank you. Super Saturday. If you are local, if you could get yourself to Westchester, New York, Terrytown, New York, we are having actually Super Sunday sneaking up about coming like super, super fast, the 19th, 19th, right, or the 18th, whatever that Sunday is. I think it's the 19th. The 19th. Oh, if no, you, 18th, 18th, sorry. 18th, okay. If you do not live local to here, you can look in the back office, coach back office, and you can search events that are close to you. There is nothing like live events. It will really make a major change in how you view the business and how you just feel in general. So it's so nice to meet other coaches live and in person. Peggy and I were talking about this before, like never met her, but I've obviously know her from being here on Facebook and everything, but I'm really looking forward to meeting her. So it's a great opportunity to do things like that. And speaking of our Super Sunday event in Westchester, huge shout out to Team Spark, Team Fit and Natural Coaches. Five coaches going to the big old cocktail party um, from my team. I have Peggy and Kristen and Therese from your team. You have Rachel. Rachel, Laura Schiller, and Lindsay Medvin. Awesome. Five of the top seven are from our teams. So I think that is awesome. You guys are incredible, and Therese and I are incredibly, incredibly proud of you guys. So thank you so much for all of your hard work, and I'm really excited to meet all of you in person. <laughs> I think that's it for all of the announcements. Oh, wait, the, ah, I keep forgetting, sorry. The sales, I know, Sharice, I forgot. The sales. I know, I'll have a seven-day free group. Oh, yeah, that too. Um, this is what happens when I don't have anything written down. Um, so the sales, 21 Day Fix, 21 Day Fix Extreme, the 21 Day Fix Kickstart, and the Beast are all on special this month for the challenge packs. So we definitely want to encourage those. It's going to be a great lead-in to Hammer and Chisel because those are the trainers who are the creators of Hammer and Chisel. So, um, and the uh, 21 Day Fix is super popular, so it's a really good program um, that attracts a lot of people. So definitely, um, definitely be inviting people and informing people about the sale pricing. Um, and our seven-day free group, I think it's going really well. It's going to be ending on Sunday, and I will be posting a video on Sunday explaining the options of what's going to happen at that point. So here are the options. Number one, they can buy a challenge group, a challenge pack rather, and join the challenge group that is starting on the 19th. Option number two, if they are just loving it and they want to become a coach, they can absolutely become a coach. And then if they became a coach, you would just enter them right into the chat. You don't want to give them a week off. You would just enter them right into our current challenge group um, because now they're a coach. So um, those are your two options. So I will be presenting that to people in a video. Please make sure you tag your participants in the video. I'll tag them when I post it, but it's always good if you double tag it to make sure that they've seen it and then send them a private message and just make sure they've seen the video. You know, have you seen the exit video about what happens next? You know, I'm sure you're wondering. Um, so you can definitely take our typical challenge group exit email to challengers and tweak it a little um, so that it's, you know, you can apply it to this group. Any questions about that? We're good? All right, so on to volume. Okay. So we have a PowerPoint. Yep, let me share the screen.
Okay, so we're going to be talking about understanding volume. There are a couple of key terms that you should really know so that when you hear these, you know, initials thrown around, they mean something to you and you realize why they're important to you. So personal volume is the volume assigned to products and membership services sold in a bonus earning period by a coach personal purchases or by what you sell. So basically it's what you buy and what you sell. That is your personal volume. Um, your team volume is a little different. That is all purchases generated in your CBC as coach business center. If you see that in the, um, this PowerPoint there in your downline. Okay. Um, it does not have to be your personally sponsored coach. They just have to be in your downline, which is really, really important. Um, and then you have left leg volume and right leg volume. So as you know, as coaches, you have a right leg, you have a right leg and a left leg. The left leg volume is all the volume generated by the coaches in your downline on your left leg. Again, not always personally sponsored, just happen to be, you know, you look in your um, genealogy tree in the back and you see people that you're like, who are those people? Well, those people are helping you by getting their 90 PB each month from Shakeology to generate volume in that leg. Um, right leg volume, same thing. It's all the coaches in your right leg. The coaches do not have to be personally sponsored. So those are some, those are some really important terms that you should definitely read through this later. We'll post it in our group so you have a firm understanding of what those are. Okay, so, whoop. Sorry. <laughs> Sharice, you're messing with me now. <laughs> so, an important thing is, you sign up a new coach, and I frequently get this question. I don't understand why they're showing as inactive. You know, they signed up as a coach today. So, how do you become an active coach, or how does one of your new coaches become an active coach? When they first sign up, if they don't buy something at the point of sign up, they are inactive until there is some sort of activity. Um, now, if they have been a challenger in your challenge group, let's say, and they're, so let's say it's the seventh and their, their next order isn't going to be sent out to the 15th, they will remain inactive until that point. Um, you can ask them to call Coach Relations and move up their Shakeology ship date if you need them to go active sooner. And remember, our Beachbody week and Wednesday night at midnight. So the active statuses will all change each Thursday. And remember Beachbody specific time. So sometimes, you know, I usually, I'll check the back office when I wake up to work out at like five and sometimes it's not updated, but usually by nine or 10 in the morning it is updated and you'll see who has gone active, who has gone inactive and who is red and if they're red inactive, that means they are at risk for going inactive the next Thursday. So action needs to be taken. They need to get their 50 PV in order to keep active status. Um, and that is 50 PV points in 35 days, the past 35 days. So, and if you look, oh, sorry. I just we just had a little picture there from, if you look in your coach online store, if you were trying to figure out how much volume something has, if you're signed in as a coach, the personal volume will show up, but pretty much it's dollar for dollar. So if something costs around $90, it's going to have 90 PV. That's like a pretty easy way to think of it. Okay, so um, oh, well, that's just what I said, <laughs> sorry. Um, if you have 50 PV, the system will post your new active status or higher coach rank status the next time the system updates, which is Thursday morning. So even if you bought or sold 50 PV worth of merchandise today, you would still remain inactive until Thursday, okay? It doesn't automatically change. Um, so that's important to know. People panic about that. Do not panic. It takes a couple days for things to update sometimes. Okay, so what is a teen cycle bonus? This is something I get tons and tons of questions about. We're going to watch a really quick YouTube video from corporate that I think explains it really well. You know, a lot of people think that earning team cycle bonus is some very complicated calculation. It's really not. It's actually pretty simple. As a matter of fact, I'm going to explain to you exactly how it works 
using my kids' toys from when they were little. Okay, so here's how it works. To qualify for Team Cycle Bonus, it means you first have to become an Emerald Coach. How do you do that? Well, you have to be active and you have to enroll one new coach. We'll use wrestling great Jimmy Superfly Snooka on my left side and we'll enroll another coach on my right side. We'll use Mega Robot Guy. And once you've enrolled two active coaches, one on your left side, one on your right side, you are an Emerald Coach and you've activated your business center. What does that mean when you've activated your business center? Well, Basically, it means that you open two bank accounts that collect team volume. Now, I have my left bank account, headed by Jimmy Superfly Snooka, and my right bank account, headed by Mega Robot Guy. And now, as you enroll new coaches, you start to build your team. And guess what? I just enrolled Mr. Monkey, and I'm gonna put him right here under Jimmy Superfly Snooka. And guess what? Mega Robot Guy just told me that he found an astronaut to join him on his team. And you know what? The astronaut happens to know Lizard Man and put him on his team. And hey, Jimmy Superfly Snooka, he is on fire. He just found this odd yellow armadillo and this ornery cougar, and the ornery cougar happened to know Mousy, who joined them on their team. But wait, Mega Robot Guy here, he just found this green guy, but we don't know his name, but you know what, who cares? He's doing a challenge room. And the green guy, he just brought in some kind of weird cat, and back on Superfly side, Mousy brought in Mad Turtle and T-Rex, and the team just keeps building. So, what happens now? Well, as this organization grows, every time someone does a challenge or sells a challenge pack or another product or buys something, they create team volume. And the team volume from each one of these purchases all roll up into your banks. So, let's imagine that every one of these guys happens to sell Shakeology. So each of them have 90 team volume points associated with them. So let's look here at the robot guys. We've got 20 coaches times 90 team volume points. That's 1,800 points in my right bank. And over here on Jimmy Superfly Snuka side, he has 10 coaches times 90 volume points from Shakeology. So that's 900 points on my left bank. Oh, wait, wait a minute. What's that, Superfly? Uh -huh. Really? Wow. Superfly just said that in addition to their own Shakeology HD orders, everyone on his side sold three Insanity Challenge packs. So each of them are producing 300 points. 10 times 300 is 3,000 team volume points. Fantastic job, guys. Robot guy, you guys better get to work. Now, the week ends, and you want to know how much team cycle bonus you earn. Well, here's how we figure it out. You earn one team cycle for every balance 300 team volume points in your bank. That means we're going to subtract 200 from the side that has the most team volume and 100 from the other side. And every time we can do that with the balance that's left in your team volume accounts, you earn a cycle. So let's go back. I have 3,000 on Jimmy Superfly Snooka side and 1,800 on the Robot Guy side. So Jimmy Superfly Snooka side has more volume. So I'm going to subtract 200 from that side and 100 from Robot Guy side. Okay, let's do the math. 3,000 minus 200 is going to leave me with 2,800 points. And 1,800 minus 100 on the other side leaves me with 1,700 points on my right side. So that's one cycle. All right, let's see if we can do it again. I subtract 200 from the side with the most team volume, so that's 2,800 minus 200, which leaves me a balance of 2,600 on that side. On that side, I subtract 100, which leaves me a balance of 1,600 on that side. You have just cycled twice, oh, so much fun. And we just keep going until we run out of team volume. So, can I do it again? 
Yes, that's three cycles. Can I do it again? That's four cycles. And again, five cycles. And again, six cycles. And again, seven cycles. And again, eight cycles. And again, and again, and again, and again, and again, and again. Just 15 cycles. Uh -oh. I just ran out of team volume on Superfly side. Oh well, I still cycle 15 times. Now, how much is that worth? Well, if I'm an Emerald coach, I make $14 for every cycle. So I would have earned $210. And if you're a Ruby coach, you would earn $16 per cycle. So that would be $240. And if you are a Diamond coach, you would earn $18 per cycle. That's $270. And I still have 300 points in my right bank. And that will stay in my bank and roll over to the next week as long as I stay active. Now, if I go inactive, it all goes away and I gotta start all over again from scratch. So that's how it works. Now, I've gotta get back to work. Superfly, you're in. Astronaut guy, you're in. Okay, yes, he's a little goofy, but you know what? I think he definitely breaks it down in a very clear way for everyone to understand how exactly it works. Um, so I hope, I hope that helped clear it up a bit. Um, so it is, it is actually pretty simple. Every leg has, every coach has two legs. Once there's 200 team volume points in one leg and 100 from the other leg, a coach will earn a cycle bonus of either 14, 16, or 18 dollars, depending on what what rank the coach is. And now, you know, you might say like, oh, "Wow, 14 dollars, 16 dollars, 18 dollars." Guys, when you build your teams, I am speaking about my own personal experience here, and I know Dave has posted stuff, you know, about his personal experience. It can be hundreds of dollars each week, okay? So it is, it's not something that is just like a little, you know, drop in the bucket. There are weeks I, I don't sell anything, and I have always gotten a paycheck from Beachbody because of my team cycle bonus. So it is really, really important, and that's why I really work hard to keep my active status because I do not ever want to lose that bank. Um, so it is really a very vital thing. So how do you qualify? How is this going to happen? How do you get it? Um, well, number one, you have to be an Emerald coach. So that is big incentive for you to be an Emerald coach. So to be Emerald, you need to sponsor two other active coaches into the business, one on your left, one on your right. They must be active. Um, and again, active coach is someone who has 50 PV. Um, the 50 PV can come from sales, personal purchases, um, things of that nature. Um, if the volume is being generated below you and you're not Emerald, you don't get a team cycle bonus. It's money that you could be earning that you're unfortunately missing out on. So it's really, really vital to get yourself to Emerald. So this is... This isn't as cute as Jimmy Stuckafly, whatever, the wrestler guy, <laughs> but this is another visual that shows you how much you can earn based on a team cycle bonus. Um, so this coach has, you know, obviously more coaches on the left leg than the right leg. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. So there's 740 total team volume in the coach's organization. So that's the whole team. 540 in the left, 200 in the right. So that coach would cycle two times, earning $14 per cycle or $28. Um, there's still 140 left over, but that will remain in their bank um, and will be activated once they earn some more. Okay, and this segues very nicely into why you should sign up your spouse or significant other immediately. If you are not Emerald, you want to have, or even if you are Emerald and you have not signed up your spouse at this point, you want your spouse as high up on uh, your tree of, your leg rather, of coaches as possible. Because even if you're just signing them up as sort of a figurehead and they're never going to work the business, which is the case in my household, um, 
you want them to benefit from the team cycle bonus. So it's really, really important. By essence, you're double dipping. You get um, sales, sales volume and you get the other volume. So what I'm, sorry, what I'm trying to say, like, I put all my sale, everything I'm buying, if I'm buying, like when I buy hammer and chisel, when I buy other things, I put it through my husband's account. So he's getting the sales volume, I'm getting the team volume, and it's helping me to cycle more. So it's really double dipping, but it, it's allowed, and it's definitely something that, you know, each body's okay with. Um, Placement is critical when it comes to making money with Beachbody. You can definitely do well if you sign up with an active team like ours and add, that adds coaches every single day. Um, if you're on a team that doesn't grow, that's definitely going to make it hard for you to make money. But lucky for all of you, we're on a really good team here because we have such amazing people like you guys. Um, so it's really important to sign up that spouse immediately. If your spouse is not signed up, you want to sign them up. I signed Mike up as my very first coach, um, along with Lisa Marr. That's how I became Emerald's coach way back when. And, you know, it was a joke at first because I'd be like, honey, you made $14, you know? <laughs> and he was like, woohoo, what am I going to do with my $14? But now, almost two years later, that $14 isn't $14 anymore. It's definitely, it's, it can be upwards of a couple of hundred. So, and he does nothing. He does not work the business at all. I have worked his business up to a diamond coach. Um, but even when he was just an emerald, you know, he was definitely, you know, $100, $150 a week. But you know what? That's my groceries. So I like having my groceries covered by Beachbody from his account. And that's on top of what I was making. So um, it's really, really important. So, and if you sign up your spouse or significant other, you're only one coach away from getting that Emerald status. So it's really, really important. Um, they do suggest that you place your spouse in your weak leg because once you have team volume accumulating in your strong leg, you can make all of your retail sales through your spouse's business center. This will enable you to double dip, like I mentioned before. You'll earn the 25% commission and cycle bonus on all of your sales, which is really nice. So, for example, on a typical Shakeology sale, you earn $30. But if you were to also be able to earn a team cycle bonus on that same sale, you would earn between $14 and $18 additional dollars. So, you know, you can turn that $30 into $40 to $48, which that doesn't sound like a huge amount, but do it a couple times a month, and it definitely adds up. All right, Sharice, you wanna sure. take over here? Yep. So for some of the key things to remember for volume, um, the things that are gonna be most important to you, to hit Success Club in a given month, you need five Success Club points, and you also need 90 PV on Home Direct purchased by you. So just because someone bought Shakeology from you that month, it would actually not fulfill the 90 PV on HD requirement for Success Club. So you do have to um, get a home direct order. You can do that either with a Shakeology home direct order, or now you can order all three of the Shakeology boosts on home direct, and that will also satisfy your um, Success Club requirement. So that is very important. A lot of people don't understand that. They don't realize that the 90 PV Home Direct has to be purchased by you. So that if that's one of your biggest takeaways, so be it, write it down. You can't forget that for hitting SC. To maintain active status, which is necessary to hold rank, you need 50 PV. But this 50 PV can be purchased by you or it can be from sales. So. You would have active status if someone bought the three-day refresh complete kit from you. That would be enough to give you active status. Um, active status requirements change depending on your rank. You don't really have to worry about it until you hit diamonds because up until you hit diamonds, you just need 50 PV to hold your rank. But when you're diamond, it jumps to 100 PV. So at that point, it's really never an issue because you'll have so many sales and you'll have orders on home direct at that point. So it, 
it's just really never going to be an issue by the time you're diamond, but you do need 100 PV to be diamond. As far as where to find the volume information, so when you're in your coach online office, you want to go to my business, then my volume, and then my volume again. And then you'll see that there's columns of numbers and you can click on any of the numbers in the columns that are labeled either total PV, LV, or RV, left and right leg volume, to see exactly where the volume came from and you can see which coaches contributed to that. So if I click on my right leg, I can see exactly which coaches in my right leg contributed to volume and how much they contributed. And then also on the home page of your Coach Online Office, like when you just directly sign into the Coach Online Office, that very first page, there's the square in the middle, which automatically defaults to Success Club. But there's also other tabs up there, which I don't know if you've ever clicked anything but the Success Club tab there, because I think it was like a month went by for me as a coach before I realized there were other tabs there. But there's personal volume and team, vo team volume, and those tabs show you graphs. So you can see how things are trending for you with your personal volume and for your team with team volume during the 35 day bonus period. And this, I, for any of my working coaches, you've probably heard me preach about the sponsorship drill down, but it is such an important, important tool. Um, and I just think that everybody should get in the habit of checking it regularly. So, the sponsorship drill down in the Coach Online office shows you the status um, and the pending status or you know what's about to happen on Thursday for all of the coaches in your entire downline as well as their rank and their SC points. So to see the sponsorship drill down, if you haven't gone there or if you haven't been looking there regularly, you go into the Coach Online office and again, you go to my business, then you go to my downline and then sponsorship drill down and once you are emerald you should be getting in the habit of checking this every day because your rank is going to depend on the active status of the people below you so you want to be watching their status like a hawk you should not be depending on your upline diamond or your upline star diamond to do this for you although you know I'm sure Jen and I will both admit to doing it and keeping an eye out for everybody. It is your job to do it. You should know before we do. So on Thursday, when it's the beginning of a new Beach Body Week, if you're Emerald or higher, you should go right to your sponsorship drill down that morning and look and see if anybody has the word inactive written in red. Because if they do, that means that if the person doesn't buy or sell 50 PB by Wednesday night, which is the end of the current Beach Body Week, they will lose active status and most likely that will affect your rank and it could affect their rank if they're you know an emerald coach beneath you or something and it could affect the coaches above you too so um, it has a lot of ramifications it's something that you want to be aware of and like Jen said in the beginning if somebody is you know possibly going to be going inactive it could be because just their Shakeology order is scheduled to ship that week so maybe the week starts on the 10th and their Shakeology order always ships on the 12th. So they would be read inactive until the 12th for that little part of the week. So maybe that's the deal. Um, you can always go back if you click on their um, coach ID number in the sponsorship drill down, it will show you their order history. So you can see like, oh, they always get their Shakeology on the 12th. Okay, no big deal. But then if the 12th passes, and they haven't become red, then you have to make a note to go back and ask them. Maybe they canceled their home direct order. Maybe they decided to skip a month. So you can't just assume that it's going to be okay. Um, so that's very important. Um, let's see, let me stop the share for a minute and just see if anybody has any questions regarding volume before we keep going. Any questions at all? Okay, type them in the chat. I know this is like a really dry topic, but it's just so important and we get so many questions on it. So I just wanna make sure everybody's clear. So we are not going to have a call next week because I will still um, 
while I'll be getting home very late that night from my vacation. But we do have some homework for you. And the homework is to use the power of three. And those of you that um, were in our new Coach Basics group last month are familiar with the power of three. But basically, it's to use a tracking system each day, which can be a piece of paper or it can be a Google Doc where you just write the things that you want to do three of each day. And you commit, I just want to see if you could commit to doing this every day and see what happens with your business. I think you will be very happy. So if you every day invite three people to the next challenge group, and then you invite three people to learn about coaching, keeping in mind that our new one hour coach recruitment event will be on October 21st. So I know it's hard for a lot of you to just ask people to think about being a coach, but if you have something to invite them to, then it kind of takes the burden off of you. You can just say, you know, take a look at what I do. I think you'd be really good at it for X, Y, Z reason. So you do have something to invite. So invite three people to learn about coaching. Follow up with three people. So follow-ups are for people who said no a while ago, people who asked you to check back another time or people who simply didn't answer you, like maybe you were somewhere in the five-step invitation process and you just lost them somewhere through. Follow up with those people. And every day, add three Facebook friends. As a reminder, check your friends' mutual friends. Check the different interest groups you are part of. Like if you're in an I Love Disney group, I'm in like 20 Disney groups, I think. You can you know, comment on somebody's post, have a little chat, and then add them as a friend. Do not add other coaches or people who are already friends with coaches on our team and think that that counts to your three new Facebook friends because that does not go towards your end goal with this. It's great if you want to be buddies with them and friends, but don't count them as your three Facebook friends um, because it doesn't count. And you also want to form three people. So that's just starting a conversation with three people just to be friendly that has nothing to do with each body. It could be a conversation in the comments of a post. It could be on private message like, oh, I love that craft that you did with your son for Halloween. How did you make that? Something like that. Just a very casual conversation. So if you invite them to do beach body down the road, then it doesn't feel like a cold invite. So that is my homework for you. And um, that's about it. Does anyone have any questions at all? All right. Well, thank you guys. I will um, post this up on YouTube and we'll share it with the team. Make sure you tag any coaches on your team, especially new ones, um, to review this because this is a really important topic. We'll put up the link to the slides and to the presentation. All right. So have a great week and we will talk to you soon. Good night. Bye.